What's up, antivirus freaks? How's it going? So today, this afternoon, I'll be taking a look at a Viper Internet Security 2012. I already have it downloaded, but um, because I had to restart, and if I restart my video, my recording just goes bye bye. Because I'm on a virtual machine, so I got download. You just have to follow the steps. You go download. Type in your email, get my free trial, check your email. It brings you the download page, download, or follow the instructions, and it's good. The, the download and install takes about five minutes, and once you restart, you get you get this. Congratulations, you rock. Join ThreatNet. Sure. And it's here. So what we got here is we got, um, you got scan status. It was you did it, it does a quick system scan when it restart when it when it installs. Next schedule scan is tomorrow at eleven PM. You can change that. Active protection is enabled, email protection is enabled. Updates, automatic updates are enabled, definitions are current. We're gonna make sure. Boom, it's current. Cool. Firewall. Let's check settings. Enable intrusion detection system definitely. Um, enable web filtering, web filtering settings. Um, sh these are all their allowed websites, allowed applications. You can allow an application. Web filter, you can sure I'd block third party advertisements. Web page content filtering. If you want, you can block JavaScripts, block VB scripts, block ActiveX. If you want, I won't because the in, my Google Chrome needs those to run. Especially if I'm playing a game. So that should be good. Apply, OK. Firewall, IDS settings, high priority intrusions, block, medium priority intrusions, allow low priority intrusions. Um, Let's check details. If it's a back door, you know, I'd block that with a notify. I'd block it. I'd um allow with a notify and high priorities. I'd always block I'd block it with a notify. I wanna know what happens. That's important. Okay. Um Log packets going to unopened ports. That's enable that. Um, sure, because sometimes someone will see if someone's trying to hack your computer, they'll send a packets. It's hard to explain what these are, but um, they'll send something t to your a port and see which port is opened on your um, to see which one is blocked and open so that's log packet so I can see what's happening cool host yeah definitely enable host definitely exceptions I'm gonna block with notify hips for advanced users only like me that's pretty cool um, email protection I use Gmail, don't worry about that. Active protection. Make sure all these are checked. They are. Scan options, whatever. Updates. Sure, apply. Okay. Let's get right to the testing, people. Where? Domain list, MDL. So I have to fix my mic here. Give me a sec. Okay, there we go. Recent updates. See if Viper also has a web blocker. Not found, okay. Trojan, sure. Number one. Boom. Viper's term of the site you're trying to visit visit contains potentially harmful or objectionable content. Okay, cool. 
blocked, number one blocked. Um, number two... Doesn't look like it's gonna work. Oh, it blocked by Viper, number two blocked. Three blocked. <laughs> this is gonna be easy. I'm gonna see if it'll block the redirect. Four blocked. Sweet. Um. Let's see if it blocks this fake AV. Viper antivirus did not. Boom. Awesome. Viper Industry does get detect that the fake AV is harmful. Awesome. Number five blocked. Um, number six. Number six blocked. This is easy. Number seven. Block. Um, blocked. <laughs> awesome. I like it. See if it blocks the this one got through the antivirus because the Trojan was hidden inside the zip file. So see if the um, web blocker will block it. This is number eight. Awesome. That's incredible. I'm happy. Blocked. Um... Number nine, I think. Number nine blocked. Root kit, see if it blocks this root kit. Number ten. Blocked. Excellent. And one more. We'll do like a really new one here. This one right here is zero day threat. Boom, blocked. Awesome. So that was 100% for Viper. Internet security blocked everything. Even the um, fake AV, the exploits, everything. It blocked everything. Um, I mean, the quarantine will have nothing in it. You can check out the firewalls. And um, items blocked by web filter. One advertisement. Cool. Um, that's cool, so this is just their, uh, firewall. So yeah, it blocked everything. The web blocker seriously blocked, like, everything. Awesome. That's incredible. So this is the, um, Viper Inner 2012. It worked great. It worked actually outstanding. 100%. That's incredible. Hmm, pretty cool. Costs, I th uh, let's check. Um, it costs uh, 50 bucks for two years. That's good for two years, for two year license. That's really good. Buy a one year subscription of Viper, get a second year free. Cool. Limited time offer. That's probably their like boxing week sale. So that's cool. Um, that's my review for the Viper in Security 2012. I'll get this uploaded as soon as I can. And at, later today or maybe tomorrow, I'll figure out when I'll get the um, MSoft anti malware going. And uh, yeah, and uh, school starts Monday, so I, um, I might not be doing videos that often, like maybe once a week at max because school is more is important so I'll talk to you guys later thanks for watching Viper did an incredible job incredible job 100% talk to you guys later have a good afternoon bye